Hello everyone, I'm meteorologist Violet Skyber. Have you ever heard of a snow ratio? Well, it's basically the amount of water that converts over to snow. And one inch of water can create a different amount of snow depending on the temperature. So let's say in this box we have temperature of 34 degrees, 30 degrees in the middle, and 18 degrees on this side. Now, as we fill it up with one inch of water's worth of snow, you can see there's different amounts depending on how cold it is. So for that 34 degree box, we have five inches of snow, which equates to heavy wet snow, about 20 pounds per cubic foot of that type of snow. As we go towards 30 degrees, that's where you get 10 inches of snow, which is typical snow, about 10 pounds per cubic feet. And then this is where, where we usually see a lake effect type snow. It's 18 degrees. We get that really cold air being drawn across the warm Great Lakes. And we can get up to 20 inches of snow with just one inch of water. But it's very light and fluffy. Dry snow is what it's called. And it only equates to about three pounds per cubic feet. So quite a difference between the three. Hopefully this clears up anything you need to know about snow ratios.